Damien, the hard slog of pre-season's almost over and it's game time now and for you particularly going back to the Scarlets, it's exciting times. Yeah, I think it's uh, all the boys enjoy the chance to kind of put the six weeks we've done into practice, you know, actually get some rugby played. Um, everyone wants to get our first hit out done as well, you know, get the body back into things, ready for the season. So um, I think it'll be interesting. We've got a lot of new, new boys who have shown up really well in pre-season, um, along with the old boys as well. And obviously, coming back to Scarlet, it'll be an interesting little uh, journey as well. So yeah, it should be good. For you, though, it's your second year at the Chiefs. You're more settled. You had a really strong finish to the season last year. Now it's a case of, I suppose, building on all that. Yeah, I think we've, you know, there's, there's a, a group of guys here who are challenging for starting spots in each position. So the, the key thing to do is just to try and push each other on as much as we can. And when you're in that starting spot, you need to obviously try and cement yourself there and keep, and keep moving on because the, the way it works here is if, you, you know, if you're not, not playing well, there's, you can guarantee there'll be about two or three boys behind you who are. So you know, that's, that's the challenge for, for myself and you know, a lot of the boys as well. But for you personally, you must take a lot of positives from the way you finished last season. Yeah, no, I enjoyed it. Was, it, was, and, it was good. and some good rugby. Yeah, it was good to, good to get in the team and have a, have a run. You know, it's a, it's a good, good place to be down here, but obviously it's much more enjoyable when you are actually playing. So, yeah, I really enjoyed it. As for the Scarlets this weekend, played them twice last year. We know what's coming, basically. Yeah, I mean, they'll be, they'll be pretty, pretty confident, bearing in mind, I think they finished very highly in their league. Um, so I think it'll, they've got a lot of youngsters down there as well. So I think a lot of those will, will relish a chance to have a you know, challenge against the Premiership outfit, really. So yeah, it should be a tasty little game, yeah. In terms of pre-season, though, it's always a slog, but things this year have been a bit different. You've done, gone out and tried new things. Yeah, it's been an interesting one. It's been, it's been fun as well, which is, which is good. Um, it's actually been a, a good six weeks, a hard six weeks, but a good six weeks. So I think everyone's, everyone's enjoyed themselves and, and worked hard in equal measure, really. And when you look around the squad, you talk about the new guys coming in as well. There's gen like generally added competition, but a lot of class coming in as well. Yeah, that's it. I mean, we've got Welsh internationals coming in, etc. You know, obviously Fetu is uh, international as well. You know, all the all the boys who've come in have added something. Um, and the thing they've added mostly is the fact there's a real, real competition for places in now. So it'll be interesting to see the uh, the squad that's picked for the first uh, league game of the year. Rob said this is the first chance for all of you to state your claim yeah. for that Northampton. How much are you looking forward to the new season? Uh, I suppose the Premiership and the Heineken Cup. Oh, massively. I mean, the fact that we're in the Heineken Cup again is a is a big deal to everyone. Uh, you know, the club and the area as well. So I think everyone's you know really keen just to look like Rob says, put a marker down as it's playing well. Um, you know, obviously you're. Training in the pre-season is all well and good, but you need to get on the pitch and show what you can do to try and you know put yourself in, in that in that spot there really. Excellent.